Pentagon warns Congress money is running out for Ukraine. U.S. Pentagon controller Michael McCord has warned U.S. Congress of catastrophic consequences for Ukraine should funding for its ongoing defense be unavailable or delayed within the currently tabled continuing resolution in his letter to minority leader Congressman Hakeem Jeffries. McCord cites specifically that Ukraine's air defenses, such as Patriot and Stinger missile systems, that have been keeping Ukrainian cities safer by destroying hundreds of incoming Russian drones and missiles every week, rely on ammunition being produced in U.S. factories. Any delay in funding would endanger U.S. support to the country's ground operations at a time when Russia is ramping up operations for a winter offensive. McCord explains that a lack of funding would not only be a disaster for Ukraine, but for the newly renewed U.S. defense industrial base that was largely dormant for many years. It is this dormancy that is often cited as the primary reason for the increased military ambitions we're seeing from China and Russia. The letter states that the other funding tool we need are those funds provided to replenish our military's inventories for the weapons and supplies we've provided to support Ukraine in their fight via drawdown. We have only $1.6 billion remaining of the $25.9 billion Congress has provided. Continuing that, without additional funding now, we would have to delay or curtail assistance to meet Ukraine's urgent requirements, including for air defence and ammunition that are critical and urgent now as Russia prepares to conduct a winter offensive and continues its bombardment of Ukrainian cities. The letter also states that 155mm unmanned aerial systems to detect, analyse and locate adversary signals and demolitions equipment. It would affect training, maintenance and sustainment of the equipment we have previously provided and other weapons for Ukraine will not be able to be supplied unless more funds are released. The other assistance will be cut.